I wish my skin always gave like shut the fuck up. Oh my gosh, why is this all out? Please hold on. Anyways, I wish my skin always gave like um you know, you don't know. But that's not the point. The point is that my skin sometimes gives this like either dry or really oily. Where's the mic at? I hope I'm not holding this incorrectly to the point where you guys can't hear me, but my skin sometimes gives like dry and then, wait, why am I lying? My skin always gives oily as fuck. Like if you know my, if you know me, my skin is always oily. So I don't know why I just lied to y'all. I'm not a liar, by the way. I feel like all men, and I can say this because I'm half a man. I feel like all men that lie so you know die die and then go to hell that's that's just what i feel personally personally and i know a lot of people that feel like this too i just feel like they should die and go to hell <laughs> and i mean that in the most sincere way possible because what's the point What's the point of being a liar? Let's get into that. Like, why, what are you lying for? Like, it has to be some deep-rooted, like, issue from your childhood that, that makes you want to lie. That like, just lie about the smallest things ever. Just lie to ruin someone's life. Just lie to ruin someone's, like, you know, just to just ruin them, to ruin their day, to ruin just everything. Like, why are you lying? That's so, like, just die. Whew. Can you tell that I just wanted to get that off my chest? Okay? I really just wanted to get that off my chest. <clears throat> Hold on. Do people make YouTube videos while laying down? I've never seen anybody do it. Also, I'm surprised that I'm fucking recording right now. I don't think I'm gonna post this. I'm just recording. Just to record. If I do post it, then I post it. By the way, this is EOS. Whoever from EOS made this lip balm, they need their booty ape. I'm sorry. But like they need their booty ape because like it's too good. And the flavor is too good. Like I, I'm not gonna say I'm not gonna say I sit here and like put it on just to lick it off, but like Sometimes in the in the day I just get nervous or I just like lick my lips out of like habit and it's just it's too good like it could be food but you know it can't be food at the same time because that would be t like you can't eat that <laughs> do I have to explain you can't okay let me explain so if you were to eat chapstick right I'm pretty sure it would make you sick I I think your stomach would ache it'll probably give you like some type of like some type of like poisoning right R right or wrong right <sighs> i don't know moral of what i was trying to say is that you cannot eat chapstick okay so really don't try to do it even if it's the eos that you like that you put on don't just lick it but don't eat it like you're going to want to eat it. Trust me, you're going to want to eat it. But it's not worth it. It's not worth it. It's really not. Okay, so I know you've all been like wondering where I've been at. And where I've been at is depressed. I've been depressed. And I'm not going to sit here and say I have been as if, as in like past tense. I am depressed. And I don't know. I just had like, I have. A random burst of energy right now and I just randomly pick up the camera now I'm just randomly talking into the camera and I don't know so so what made me depressed or what makes me depressed who knows um, life makes me depressed okay since we're getting there and I'm gonna treat this camera as my therapist I say that as if I have a therapist in the first place I don't have a therapist 
but I'm going to treat this camera as a therapist, not my therapist, because I don't have one. So I'm depressed because I'm nowhere in life. And at my big age, I feel like I should be somewhere in life, but I'm not. But at the same time, as people tell me, tell, people tell me all the time, that I have a lot of time. I'm still young. I'm 25. I I feel like I'm old. I feel like I'm an old man. Like compared to other people, because I mean, I guess I surround myself with people that are younger than me. But like, well, not everyone's younger than me. But the few people that are younger than me, I just I just look at them like, damn, um, I'm a bit older than them, and I'm not like. Okay, this unrealistic thought. I'm not like, I don't have all this money. I don't have way, 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 way more than them. So it's like, so I feel like I have a bugger. I'm sorry. I don't have way more than them. So it's like, um, what am I doing with my life? I might as well just kill myself. Let me stop. Why would I say that on camera? I don't know. Will I take that out? Probably not. Because I don't care. I really don't. And that's my issue. I just don't care about a lot of things that I should care about. Um, but what was I saying? Yeah, I'm depressed because of that. I'm nowhere in life. And uh, I just have no motivation to do anything. And um, yeah, I just procrastinate everything. I st nothing that I want to happen for me happens so then that just makes me feel even more sad and depressed and i just feel worthless and let's not get into everything okay y'all trying to trick me y'all trying to get me i'm not gonna let y'all get me chill no it's not gonna happen chill anyways anyways let's just get into the fact that oh if y'all live in miami or if any of y'all live in miami if you don't you're gonna know now but now you don't know you know and you're gonna know but you don't know then you're now you're gonna know but if you don't know you're going to end up knowing because i'm gonna let you know so this past like week there's been like no gas and it's been fucking terrible so me being me i'm a procrastinator and i'm fucking like terrible and I'm fucking stupid and I'm fucking dumb. So, I let myself get to, I let my car get to like five miles. And, okay, let me backtrack, let me backtrack. So, there has been like no gas in the gas stations because um I guess they were saying like because of the floods that we had. Which, why is the light, like why did the light go out? It's because the fucking TV. So the fucking TV. But it's because the floods that we had and I guess that did something to the gas and a lot of gas stations had no gas and I guess long story short there was a lot like long ass lines to the with the at the few gas stations that did have gas. And maybe maybe me, I'm not gonna wait on at no on no line that's around the corner, around the block. Why why I'm gonna wait there? Why? Okay, so now fast forward. My car ends up being on five miles left. Five miles, so I'm panicking, I'm about to cry. Cause I, I, I end up just pulling my car over into like the nearest parking lot. I'm just sitting there for a minute and I'm like panicking, about to cry. I'm like, I'm just gonna take an Uber and leave my car here because I'm, I'm not gonna make it home. Mind you, my five miles left in my car, I was like five miles away from my house. But me being smart and me i'm like i don't think i'm gonna make it there so would i would i rather just park my car and take an uber or would i rather you know try to drive the full five miles home and make it there i mean try to drive the full five miles home and not make it there and be stuck literally in the middle of the street and have to push my car like out the street mm, you do the math because i'm not pushing a motherfucking thing i'm sorry i'm not pushing nothing so then i'm texting friends i'm like I don't know what to do. And then they were like, you need to speed. You need to try to speed home. And then, mind you, this Uber's already coming. So I'm like, okay, fuck it. Yeah. I just canceled the Uber and it charged me six dollars. It charged me six dollars. To cancel the Uber, it charged me six dollars. Which, I mean, 
I did kind of waste the Uber's time, but I don't give a fuck about your time. Like, I'm on my time. I'm not on their. I'm not on their time. I'm on my time because I'm literally panicking. I don't know what to do. I'm about to cry. I'm about to bust the views because my car had no miles left. It had no miles. So, you know what I did next? Cancel the Uber. Said fuck it. I'm gonna try to make it home. If I don't make it home, I'm gonna be a not. I'm not gonna be a bitch, and I'm gonna push that car over. So as I'm speeding down Biscayne Boulevard, yes, that's the road I'm speeding down Biscayne Boulevard. I see a gas station whose line is not around the corner. So I'm like, yeah. So moral of the story is God got me. God had my back. God knew if it was a line that was longer than it was, I wasn't going to get in that line. I'm sorry. I wasn't going to get in that line. Mind you, most of the gas stations are closed. So it's like, that's on top on top of the line being short. The gas station is actually like, it has gas. And on top of the gas being there, it was the gas that my car actually needed because a lot of the gas stations only only had like regular gas or um, extra or whatever. And my car needs premium. So I'm like premium gas, line notch like around the block around to like the next city. And then it's right there where like right where I started to like start speeding past. Yeah. So God had my back. So at the end of the day, I feel like Oh, hold on. So at the end of don't play them. So at the end of the day, I feel like when things get hard, when things get real tough for me, like real, 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 real tough for me, God's gonna have my back. So moral of the story is, don't assume the worst is going to stay the worst, because the worst didn't stay the worst for me in that situation. I mean, things are still bad for me. But the worst thing to stay the worst for me in that situation, and it's because God got me, okay? And if you don't believe in God, believe in somebody else who you believe in. Believe in your mama, believe in your daddy. If things get be, if things end up being good, just say, thank you, daddy, thank you, mama. And in my situation, I said, thank you, God. Amen. So, <clears throat> there's that. On top of that, there's other things that I could talk about, but am I gonna talk about? No, I don't really care to talk about it because it's really not like interesting. As if my story for the gas was interesting. If it was, I don't care. Wait, if it wasn't, I don't care. <laughs> if it was, love you damn. Thank you for thinking it's interesting. Love you damn, okay? I just picked up the camera. Like I said, I had like a random burst of energy. Don't know if I'm gonna post this video. But if I do, it's just gonna be an update as me you know i'm alive barely but i'm alive living am i thriving no not yet but i will one day without a doubt I, I, I will be thriving one day without a doubt okay don't play with me that's pretty much it sorry i keep looking at myself at this um on this viewfinder because i want to make sure that i'm like there Cause I'm not no challenge yet. I can't hold no, I I can't hold the camera without knowing where I'm at. Don't play with her. Anyways, bye.